Hello and welcome. So in this video, I will discuss about uh, the EMS and MFAG with respect to IMDG. So first we will uh, discuss what is EMS. So EMS is Emergency Response Procedure for ships which carry dangerous goods. So basically it carries the guidance of what to do in case of an emergency for the ships carrying dangerous goods. So the EMS schedules for fire and spillage of dangerous goods. So what is the intention of this uh, EMS? It is basically needed for, to assist the ship owners and the operators to guide the crew of the ship how to operate in case of an emergency involving dangerous goods. So the it can be used in case of emergency response without any external assistance. So this EMS contains all the procedures what to do with the, uh, and work in case uh, of an uh, spillage or fire involving dangerous goods without any external assistance. So the ship's crew can uh, work and the ship's crew can take actions according to the uh, given uh, procedures. So how to use this EMS? So this EMS, first you need to identify the dangerous good. What type of dangerous good it is. How you can identify? You can identify by seeing the UN number and PSN. So after identification, you could uh, consult the specific fire and spillage schedule. So this EMS contains specific fire and spillage schedule. So why we need it to take uh, proper action or the appropriate action for that uh, uh, dangerous good, that type of dangerous good. So it contains 10 fire schedules and 26 spillage schedules. So this much is required uh, for your written exams and hope you have liked it. So Thank now you. we'll talk about MFAG. So basically it is a IMO, WHO and IL recommended medical first aid guide and which can be used in case of accidents involving dangerous codes. So it provides advice for initial management of the chemical poisoning and diagnosis. And uh, this uh, advice is uh, within the limited resource available at sea. It doesn't give uh, some uh, unwanted advice that is not possible to do at sea. So basically uh, the toxic effects of the dangerous goods, all, all the general informations are given. For treatment, the specified appropriate table and sections are made in the appendices pages of this book. For fast and uh, for fast action, a three-tiered approach is also uh, given in this book when you will go on board or I think you have seen on board in uh, case of training in, in case of training sessions. Action, a three-tiered approach is also given in this book and uh, the list of medicines and the drugs and the list of chemicals requiring for special treatments is also given in the table. So whenever you have visited the medical uh, locker or uh, hospital of the ship, you may have seen there is a special or a different section for IMDG related medicines. So these are the medicines that uh, need to be carried on, on board every ship that uh, are uh, going to carry or that are carrying uh, dangerous goods. So this much is important from the topic of MAFG and hope you have liked it. Thank you.